Welcome to Kispire Tech Guide on USB Color Code. In this video, we will explore the meaning behind the different colors used in USB ports and connectors, helping you identify their purpose and compatibility. USB color codes are essential for identifying the type and capability of a port or connector at a glance. Let's dive into what each color signifies. The first color we have here is black. It's the most common USB color representing USB 2.0. Why not the fastest? It's reliable for everyday devices. Common for basic USB ports. Supports data speeds with up to 480 megabytes per second. Widely used for peripheral devices like your keyboard, mouse, and flash drive. You can see an example of the port here, color of the port over here. So this is actually how the ports look like. Then the next one I'm looking at is USB blue, which indicates high speed USB 3.0 or 3.1. They are perfect for tax requiring quick data transfer. They are actually ID for external storage devices and high-speed peripherals. They are actually pack more compatible to USB 2.0 and their transfer speeds are actually at the rate of 5 gigabytes per second for USB 3.0 and 10 gigabytes per second for USB 3.1. You can see the port over here. This is actually where you can identify the port. Then we have the third one, which is tail. Tail is actually is the color tail. Tail is cutting edge USB versions, offering blazing fast speed for professional grade devices. And you can actually see them here. They support up to ultra fast data at rate of 20 gigabytes per second and 40 gigabytes per second for USB 3.2 and USB 4.0. They are often used for SSDs and high performance peripherals. So when we zoom in a little bit, you can see them over here. This is actually the port USB 3.1. Then the next one we have is USB red, orange, and yellow, typically in the case charging ports, ensuring your devices get powered up efficiently. So you can they are found on charging devices like most of all these new laptops, a modern generation of laptops that uses USB for charging, like Lenovo, for instance. Then they support USB charging. You can actually use the port to charge your device and also use it to transfer files. And they are common in laptops and then charging up. So you can see the um, red over here and also the yellow port over here. These are actually ensuring that your devices are powered up nicely for charging. Then the next one we we'll have is USB Gen, purple USB, which is often less common. It's not that popular, but offers impressive speed and um, versatility, catering to advanced tech users. So advanced tech users use this, have the purple USB cord. I use it to transfer files from my phone, different charging ports supports that so this is actually when you can actually get a usb cable such as this you can see it over here this is actually the purple usb ports then the last but not the least is actually usb 1.0 almost everybody has seen this is versatile is white which represents the earliest versions of usb Although slow, but today's standard is actually slow, but it's actually of today's standards. They paved the way for USB technology. They are the uh, USB that started the generation for USB. You can see the white um, plastic over here. So this is actually, they are rarely found now. You can hardly see them in modern devices because it's actually outdated. And, but legacy ports like um, some of all these old devices can actually have it. And to summarize our USB color codes, here is a quick recap of the USB color codes and their meaning. We have the black, 
which is USB 2.0, the blue, which is USB 3.0 and 3.1. Then we have the teal, which is USB 3.2 and to 4.0. Then we have the red, orange and yellow, which are charging ports. Then we have the purple, which is 3.1 Gen 2. Then we have the white, which is USB 1.0 and 1.1 knowing this can help you choose the right port for your needs and thank you for watching this guide on usb color codes don't forget to like share and subscribe for more helpful tech content see you in the next video